this is how it became part of the protectorate. Yeah. And yeah, yeah. Oh. This is, and uh, and uh, because of certain powers, yeah. some of those things are possible. Yes, some of those things are possible. Uh, some of uh, that courage was derived uh, from spiritual sides like this. No. Yeah, the, the British school was not easy for them in the Gambia. It was tough. It, came, yes. it was like the people, the local yeah. people came against a great force yeah. foreign uh, to them and their understanding and their existence, of course. So suddenly they had to uh, deal with a problem, you know, entirely new, you know, to their existence. But they managed to uh, overcome it. Overcome it, yes. So you, 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 you believe it was possible because of the backing and support they had from sides like this? Yes, you know, because the, they fought different wars here, you know. Uh, and the second battle was Sukuta, Sukuta in 1856, you know, which uh, was organized by Bakao. The, just to drive away the British, you know. Before uh, yeah. such battles were weight, the people will usually come here, as you explained. The battle is planned here. It's planned here. And okay. Yes, everything is done here. Okay, the, I mean, uh, warriors are given spiritual blessing from this place before they venture outside. Yes. Okay. The Kachikali crocodile pond is more than just a tourist attraction. It's a unique traditional and natural heritage which has a green setting containing some extremely rare tree species identified as medicinal plants. A museum within the sacred pond provides visitors with all they need to know about the prehistoric site. The Kajikali Museum does not only offer perspective on the history of Bacau and the Gambia, but also exhibits essentially invaluable items strongly connected to the country's past. Hi, I'm Lara and I'm here on holiday in the Gambia on the smiling coast. This program is brought to you by... There, there are strong spirits, I mean, protecting uh, this settlement, this area. Yes, not only this area, but the entire country. The entire country. Yes. Okay. Yes. So, but this is their main base. Yes. 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 No war can destroy this country. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, this is uh, evident yes. in the uh, people who were destroyed when they attempted uh, to uh, touch some of the resources in the country here. Yeah. yeah. The nation is small, okay. uh, but the people are great. Okay. Yeah. Anyone who comes yes. No matter okay. uh, how powerful you are, you can't defeat us. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's the natural state of the yes, Gambia. Yes. Okay. Yes. These have been proven many times. Many times. Yes. Many, many times. Okay. In spite of the end of the winter break, the Kajikali crocodile pool is attracting hordes of visitors and tourists coming to see the sacred pond in its best and greenest spectacle. Uh, are these students? Yeah, they are students. They are students. This is the first time this is their first time in the Gambia. Okay, and I mean what is the reaction after coming across this beautiful uh, natural asset? Uh, anyway, they are very, very happy with me, and uh, they are also happy to come here to see the crocodile pool here, actually. Okay. And uh, basically, these are some of them, they are first time to come to Gambia. And uh, they would like to see the crocodiles, and uh, they want to see some of these uh, items at the inside also. She must be a teacher. No, no, not a teacher. Also a no, just no, a mother to one of the students. Oh, so I'm volunteer. This must be an amazing experience. Absolutely, especially with my daughter, yes. Oh, okay. Yes. I mean, have you ever seen a of this No, no, never. No. I mean, this close. No. Have you seen them this close? Not, I've never touched one have neither till today. Have you tried it? Yes. And how was it? Weird. Weird. <laughs> <laughs> we'll try it again. Yeah, yeah, maybe, yeah, maybe. <laughs> and you, what's your name again? Daniel. Daniel. Daniel, this must be a beautiful experience. It is, it is. Uh, do you know how, what, what this place is called? Katikali. Katikali. So it's amazing, really. Yeah, it is. Beautiful. Stroking crocodiles is pretty weird. Yeah. You, you touched touch one of them? Yeah, you shook its hand. <gasps> um, you don't take your eyes off it, really. <laughs> okay. And you? <laughs> 
terrifying. Terrifying. I never knew there was a hundred in there. Really? There's more than a hundred. Apparently, yeah. I, yeah. I, 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 yeah. You touch one, do you? Yeah. Terrifying. I'm, I'm, terrified. I'm scared of touching one. I didn't touch one since I took one. No. I had to do it with someone. It's so scary. And then one moved across. Yeah. And this is your first time in the gap. Yes, definitely. And how is that experience? So different. So different. So different. It's amazing. amazing. Brilliant. What name would you give this country? What? Oh, they call it the smiling coast. Do they? Oh, yeah. Is it? Yeah. Oh, right. Brilliant. Yes. And, and what's your name? I'm Sarah. I'm Sarah. Thank you. And you? Hi. What's your Hi. name? Hi, I'm Debbie. Debbie. Uh, I've just, just been told that you've been here before. I have been here before, yes. It's the second time I've been here now. Okay. I came three years ago on my honeymoon. <laughs> on honeymoon, yeah. This must be an extraordinary honeymoon. It was an incredible honeymoon. Oh. Beautiful honeymoon. That's why I came back. Cause it was so good the first time. Oh. I came back again. And you must be loving it. I love it. I love it here. Wonderful. I love it. Thank you. Thank you. And who do we have? Beth. How, how, how are you? Thank you. Fine, thank you. You're scared of that reptile behind you? Yeah, a little bit, a little did bit. You, did you touch it? I did. Let me see you touch it again. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> you wouldn't touch it again? No. Okay, thank you. What's your name? Johnny. Johnny. Johnny, this is beautiful. Uh, where are you from? Uh, Leicester. In Leicester. England? Leicester in England. Uh, I mean, what grade are you in? Uh, grade 12. Grade 12. And you've never experienced anything like this? Never before. Never, never seen before. a crocodile before. And you've never been to the Gambia before? Too. No, it's first time. So it's your first time. And having a wholly exciting and different experience. Yeah, that's the way to put it, yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> now what will, you, what will you be saying to your friends in Leicester when you go back? Just that it's lovely. It's lovely. Really yeah, nice. To come and see yeah. for themselves. Thank you. <laughs> and you? Uh, my name is James. Oh, James. Uh, how are you feeling right now? You're around very scary reptiles. I'm not actually that scared of the crocodiles, oh, but it's. Uh, oh no, I know, I know. I'm not scared of them, but it's absolutely fantastic it's to see them here as well. And the whole experience in Gambia has been I've fantastic. Been very close. Yeah, 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 yeah. And so just having them very close. I mean, if I wouldn't get any closer to that, okay. uh, I'm just right now, but it's still very good. Are your friends out there in England? What will you tell them? It's an absolutely fantastic place here. I love the people here, and especially the crocodiles as well. Fantastic. As the mother reptiles rest under the sun, keeping watch over the young, even the crocodiles seem to be relishing the beauty brought by summer. That's all we have for you on this edition of the expedition. Join us next week for another fascinating expedition. And don't forget, you can watch this program along with many others on our website at www.grts.gm. Until we meet again, bye-bye and enjoy the rest of our programs. needed at the police station immediately. Please, you have to help me with some money. My mother was just arrested by someone she owes. So how much does she owe this person? 300 dollars. You won't lose me, mother. His mother will rather lose him. Killing is not in my lineage nor your father's. We are peaceful, loving and respectful people. And that will forever be in our history. It's me, the richest man in this village. It is your likes that rejects the bad side of good people in this village. First, you walked into my house without an invitation, and you stand before me to say rubbish. When I get to the city and settle down, I'll definitely come back and get married to you. You are a woman! This guy feels in hard currency. Those 